know about the DVD release thing. Uh, uh, just stay. Just, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna come up with with the shot as he walks in. Yeah, all right. I got shot as coming in. Okay, so we won't need it right away. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Hey guys, I don't know if you know this, but Pirates of the Caribbean. I caught the mic. That's okay. I'm gonna stand up. Maybe yeah, I'll do I the got. Same one I did on the other. How are you? Okay. Just a little further. Because these aren't going to be the same thing. So you can do it again. I can. No, I'm I'm good this way. Okay. Back a little bit. I'm going to walk in here with the ship. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Hey guys, I'm here at Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, Dead Man Tells No Tales, and this is the actual safe and chair that Jack Sparrow sat in. And uh, the new DVD is coming out soon, right now. And uh, this is it. How cool? How cool is this? I can't believe I'm in the actual one. Awesome. You're watching Fab TV. Hey, Marty. It's good to see you again. You too, boss. How does it feel to be uh, on this franchise? And I know you've been asked this a lot, but it's like it's it's getting more historic the older it gets. Right. Well, you know, I've been very blessed and very lucky to be able to uh, be a part of some, so, something so huge, and um, and to get to work with actors like Johnny Depp and uh, Jeffrey Rush, and Kevin McNally, and on, on the latest one now with Javier Bardem who like totally freaked me out when I saw uh, no, uh, no Country for Old Men. Um, but it's it's been been awesome and, you know, I, I, I hope they do two or three more. It'd be great. October 3rd, the DVD comes out. What can we look forward to to see in the bloopers or the behind the scenes on the DVD? Well, we'll see. I haven't seen it myself either, but yeah, it's going to be, uh, this is one of the first ones that Disney's going to be putting out on 4K Ultra HD. <laughs> And the Blu-ray, and uh, it actually comes out digitally today on um, September 19th, which is International Talk Like a Pirate Day. Um, so you can catch it, you know, if you want to download it right now. But you should be downloading it right now. Okay, I'll download it right now. now. Okay, I will right now. Okay. When but, your uh, daughter sees you on camera on TV, does she, she get it? Is she getting it? She, you know, it's weird. A little bit here and there, she gets it, and. Um, because everybody's like, oh, your daughter's, she's a little ham bone, and, you know, she should get into, you know, acting, and, like, I'm not really sure that I want to um, get her involved in the, in the industry until she's older, because I didn't get involved until I was later, and it's a lot easier, I think, to have a career afterwards, but, um, you know, if she shows potential, um, then maybe putting her in now, and, you know, maybe she could make enough money that she could pay for her college and stuff like that. So we'll see. I mean, she she does get it a little bit when she sees me on the Disney shows, um, whether it's like, you know, Walk the Prank or uh, Pair of Kings, stuff like that. She thinks it's funny, you know, oh, there's Dad Dad. She just thinks everything pirate is Dad Dad, you know, or anything pirate is pirate. She won't, she doesn't call him Captain Jack. She calls him Pirate Jack. And I've always got to straighten her out. I'm like, no, it's Captain Jack Sparrow. Right. So. How did you do your voice inflection and your whole, you know, pirate R thing? R. Well, the funny thing is, I don't really. I, that that's not my pirate, kind of pirate. I'm more of a uh, Cajun or you know, like Avinutis uh, Lili. The captain seems to be acting a bit strange. Mm -hmm. So even I have more voice, of a even that English accent thing is. Yeah, yeah. It, it's it's just uh, I guess. You, I don't know how to explain it. It's just something that when you're on, you're on. As soon as they say action, go. And then, you know, you're playing off everybody else. So it, it, it just kind of becomes second nature. Um, it, the hard thing is to turn it off at the end of the day mm. when you've been doing it all day long for 14 hours or something like that. But um, if there was a spinoff of, of just you? Of just me? Like I get I get my own ship. Yeah. Where I take a dinghy and not a dinghy, set up a sail. Black Pearl Two. Something. Black Pearl Two. Black Pearl. The Black Pear. Yeah, Black Pear. I like that idea. <laughs> Maybe yeah, that'd be good. Maybe the the gray pear or the silver and black. Right, right. Be the Raiders. Okay. Um, I don't know. It'd be great. I mean, I, you know, it's really weird to see yourself in coloring books, and and um, video games and. Uh, now they got this new one, the Disney Crossy Roads. So you look like this little uh, Minecraft figure going across the screen, and you know I'll get people from back in school like, posted on you know on the social media like, oh my God, my kid came across this or that, and you know you never think 30 years ago, oh someday people are gonna remember who I am, and you know now you see it and it's like whoa, 
That's kind of weird. Well, I think you're an inspiration. Oh, you're, thank you. You're awesome to watch. And, thank you. And thank you for interviewing with us. Thank you, boss. Anytime. Great, great, great to see you, man. Be good, man. I want a shirt.